Okay guys, welcome back because I can gaming and today we're going to walk you through the top gear story to get three stars on each one so you can unlock your certain cars. So like always guys, shout out to the notification gang and we are giving away three modded accounts. Check out the link in the description, go over to that video, watch the video, you got to be a subscriber, leave a comment and uh, like the video and you're entered in. I think it's going to be given away less than a week. Huge shout out to everything Forza. They're the ones doing the modded account, guys. So again, three modded account giveaway. Link in the description and check out everything Forza. With that, guys, I'm going to leave this with you. Thank you for checking me out. And it's super easy to get three stars, guys, on your first try. Thanks. First up, it's a trip to the top of Glen Rannoch by any means necessary and against the clock naturally. But don't worry, it has knobbly tyres and a roof rack for carrying extra knobbly tyres. In 400 yards, turn left. Turn left. Recalculating route. That's a four-wheel drive car on mud tires completely sideways. You'd do well in rallying with skills like that. Top draw drifting, I reckon. Who says you need an SUV to go off-road? The E80 has four-wheel drive and air suspension to smooth out lumps and bumps and everyday obstacles. Ancient burial mounds, for example. That's some proper hang time. Actual air suspension. 400 yards. Turn left. Well, it is a Mercedes wagon, so it's tough. And if you really want to smash stuff up, there's even a pickaxe in the back. Turn around when it is safe to do so. 200 yards. It also has 340 horsepower, more torque than a cruise ship, and gets to 60 miles an hour in just over five seconds. to head way over there to the very top of Arthur's seat. But first, what goes up must come down. Turn around when it is safe to do so. yards. Turn left. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Recalculating route. It's full of home comforts, the EAT. Charges for almost anything you can charge. Cozy ambient lighting, even a portable espresso machine. Everything the intrepid explorer could ever need. yards turn right turn right all right all this adventure kits had a tiny effect on the fuel efficiency good job the roof rack holds two cans of diesel and there's another one in the back just don't confuse them with your drinking water
roundabout. Take the first exit. On to the final stretch now. Just the small matter of getting up Arthur's seat. The clock's ticking, so better step on it, Stiggy. In 200 yards, turn left. In 100 yards, turn left. And there we go. The top of Arthur's seat. Nice view, though. Shame there's no time to stick around.